Hi. Welcome back here to Challenge Sports Weekly. Here at the Dairy Queen and Folks Center. I'm glad to meet you, Sam Wild. And it's time for some Indian football talk. He said this week, Welcome to the River City. We made some family county here at Indian Field. So we get the real deal this week. Sure, I'm more scrimmage and I'm more soap game. It goes into one loss column. That's the right. Most of my players back. The big boy in the Camden scrimmage. So that's all right. That'll be good. And uh, said hopefully they'll be back and ready to go. Um, Except Bremen County, they, they're going to do what they always do. They're going to spread the field now and they're going to throw the ball. So they scrimmaged uh, Arkansas County last Friday night. They, they,
surprised if, if Pierce County goes up there and sneaks uh, out with a win. But on the other hand, uh, it's hard to bet against Clinton uh, County. But it's not the real. This is going to be a big one
And um, I think this is the at First Presbyterian. This is their second year in the hospital, right? right. And uh, and they uh, they had a decent year last year. So uh, uh, until Erwin shows me something, I'm gonna have to pick the the crowd to school for right. the age. <laughs> so I don't know nothing about them. But, uh, so far, we're green on everything. Yeah. Um, it'd be interesting to see when Erwin comes here. What they had the, their new head coach. Uh, well, yeah, he was the defensive coordinator at Camden, or assistant defensive coordinator. Last. This is next team. This is the team that intrigues me the most in the region this year. Uh, I don't know what they bring back. Um, uh, they also have a new coach. Uh, I do know they got a. Uh, a very good defense of an offensive lineman right over there. Um, that's a prospect coming in, yeah, and we've got to go over there and play them. Uh, Never done that before. Uh, I've seen their field. Uh, it's not a. Uh, it's not too big, so uh, <laughs> we should back it out when we go. Uh, but uh, they play uh, at Calhoun County, so they go a bit. Uh, Ways across the state, almost over to the Alabama line, and uh, played a Calhoun County Cougars, I believe it is. Yeah, that's correct. And uh, that's over there in your old neck of the woods. It's yeah. Northern my neck of the woods. <laughs> but uh, Calhoun County, um, traditionally, I don't think they've only ever had even a playoff team. So, uh, uh, they're not a real strong team. I'm going to say Lanier goes over there and. and uh, Take care of business, yeah. I'm excited to go over there and take care of business. Uh, let's see who else we got in the region. Here we have the cover. The cover farmer, Queen, Blue Cross. That's all we hear of. Yeah, thank you. That gets us to the game of the week, which is us against Grant. Uh, how did you see that game uh, breaking down and going? I think we can, if we can line up and run the ball. Uh, Keep defense on the field. You know, probably get 28 to 7. Maybe hopefully our defense will step up. Yeah, I, uh, I think along the same lines. If we can just control the, you know, get the running game going, um, get the offense line, and get a big push, um, keep the defense off the field. And uh, control the clock, keep that, keep them on, you keep their offense on the sideline. Uh, I, I can see us putting up 28 points. Uh, I will say though that somewhere uh, one of our defensive backs gets tired and maybe slips, or something, uh, and Bradley scores 14. So I want to say 28 to 14, and uh, and that'll be late. So, okay. Uh, so. Uh, I'll say 28 to 14. Uh, just a couple other area games, non-region. Uh, Camden County is going to be actually playing Thursday night. Yeah. They moved there to the Hurricane Threat. They're going to be playing Johnson and Savannah, which you know, I don't think it matters what day they play on. But, no. And also, where and coffee will be playing each other at coffee. Very interesting game. Very interesting game. Uh, I would probably say that that one is, is a uh, you got two big programs. Uh, coffee obviously uh, is better than I thought they would be. Uh, they upset Brunswick in a couple polls was in the top five right now. Right. Right. Even coffee didn't even get a mention in the top eight. But Coffee lost their uh, quarterback with a torn ACL right. against Brunswick. And uh, he had already committed to uh, Louisville. Right. Yeah. So uh, that's a tough break for Coffee. Uh, where, I think where is, uh, yeah, I've seen him one poll, that was number six or seven. Right. Uh, so did that bring back a good nucleus of players? Uh, that's a tough call, Glenn, but uh, I think. Uh, I'll take Ware County by three points. Oh, it'll just be different since we agreed on them all the yeah. <laughs> How many? Oh, give them a touchdown. There you go. All right. Well, uh, we'll see how it pans out. But I think that's we're going to wrap up this week. And, uh, so, 
So we got, uh, we'll be back next week at any time fitness, but we appreciate Dairy Queen yes. for allowing us to film here this week and get a chance to come by and get you a blizzard or whatever. So yeah, I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Anyway, we'll be back next week at the same time, and we'll have some results, more results for you. Have a good night.